I know that after my death, a pile of rubbish will be heaped upon my grave, but the wind of history will sooner or later sweep it away without mercy. In the tumultuous landscape of World War II, the USSR bore a staggering toll, with over 20 million lives lost and widespread devastation inflicted by the invading Nazis. The sheer magnitude of destruction, encompassing 70,000 cities, towns and villages, left scars on the fabric of the nation. Despite the ravages of war, Stalin's leadership ushered in an era of profound transformation, demonstrating an ability to reshape and rebuild a nation that defied all expectations. The statistics of wartime losses are staggering, with 6 million houses, 98,000 farms, 32,000 factories, 82,000 schools, 43,000 libraries, and 6,000 hospitals obliterated, along with the extensive infrastructure such as roads and railway tracks. The USSR, however, rose from the ashes without the aid of a Marshall Plan, a feat that even capitalist Europe couldn't achieve. Stalin's governance during this era was characterized by a multitude of accomplishments, often overshadowed by the prevailing narrative. Noteworthy among Stalin's achievements was the eradication of homelessness and unemployment. His commitment to egalitarian principles extended to providing free healthcare and education for all, as well as championing equal rights regardless of gender and vehemently opposing racism and anti-Semitism. Under his rule, illiteracy was wiped out, and capitalist exploitation was abolished, ensuring that the fruits of labour were justly distributed. Stalin's transformative vision went beyond domestic reforms. He successfully defended the USSR against internal threats from revisionists and traitors, while turning the country from a semi-feudal peasant society into an industrial superpower comparable to that of the United States. And most importantly of all, the USSR, under his leadership, defeated the Nazis, ended the Holocaust, and saved the world from the menace of fascism and genocide. The legacy of his leadership is underscored by the transition from inheriting a nation with a plough to leaving it equipped with nuclear weapons as a defence against US aggression. Yet, despite these accomplishments, Stalin's historical standing is marred by vilification rather than celebration. The narrative surrounding him is shaped by Western propaganda, overshadowing the monumental strides he made for the USSR and the world at large. As we delve into the nuanced account of Stalin's tenure, the question emerges. Why is a leader who achieved so much against insurmountable odds subjected to such historical distortion? I know that after my death, a pile of rubbish will be heaped upon my grave, but the wind of history will sooner or later sweep it away without mercy.